dear viewers assalamu alaikum today we will discuss that how we can convert ic50 to ki by using online converter it is a web based application which can be used to convert ic50 to ki in enzyme inhibitor enzyme substrate inhibitor system and protein ligand inhibitor system so first we will discuss that in enzyme substrate inhibitor system we can use this calculator which which re, which requires enzyme concentration so here we have to put our enzyme concentrations like we have 0 0.06 micromolar so all units will be in micromolar and here they have given an example from this reference the enzyme substrate inhibitor system follows uh, classical Michaelis Menten kinetics and the substrate concentration will be here like here the substrate concentration is 30 micromolar I am just assuming these values and the Michaelis Menten constant Km it will be let's suppose 130 and the inhibitor your IC50 value is 3.2 micromolar so before this calculation we should know IC50 value that we discussed in our previous study that how we can calculate IC50 value and uh, we can use different types of different tools like graph pad prism or uh, Microsoft Excel to calculate the IC50 value so after putting these values we will go to calculate and we get our results that so these are our results and uh, it is important that it represents the ki values in micromolar because we have calculated we have inserted all values in micromolar and uh, it provides us all type of inhibition systems like here we have competitive type of inhibition then the value will be 2.57 micromolar in uncompetitive type of inhibition the value will be 0.596 and in non-competitive type of inhibitor the ki value will be 3.17 micromolar so it gives different type of in enzyme inhibitions and uh, for all these it calculates calculates the ki values and for tightly bound inhibitors for tightly bound inhibitors these values are also reported or given so in this way we calculate the ki values and it is based on the equations that we uh, uh, that we represented in our previous uh, video that uh, how we can calculate so these are the calculations or reactions for competitive inhibition and uh, for uncompetitive inhibition and the reactions for non-competitive inhibition so all these were discussed in our previous study videos that how we calculate the ki value and these are the cheng prusov equations and based of these cheng prusov equation that we also discussed in our previous video so on the basis of this it calculates the ki value so this converter is also based on cheng prusov equations like ki value is equal to ic50 divided by s by km plus 1 for competitive inhibition for uncompetitive inhibition it will be km divided by s plus 1 for non competitive it is this and for tightly bound inhibitors the way the formulas for tightly bound inhibitors are for competitive inhibition the ki value will be ic50 minus e by 2 which is enzyme concentration divided by s divided by km plus 1 so similarly uh, for uncompetitive inhibition and for non-competitive inhibition these are the formulas which will be used for tightly bound inhibitors in our previous video we uh, told you that we will discuss uh, tightly bound inhibitors that what formula we can use so these are the cheng prusov equations which can be used for tightly bound inhibitors and these are in three different mode of inhibitions for enzyme so before going to protein ligand inhibitor interaction uh, reactions uh, first uh, we will discuss that how we can uh, calculate the ki values for protein ligand inhibitor system so from here we will go to protein ligand inhibitor system so now we can 
कैलकुलेट के आई वैल्यूज फॉर प्रोटीन लीगेड इनहेबिटर सिस्टम एंड फॉर दिस वट पैरामीटर्स वी हैव टू इंसर्ट हेयर सो दीज आर दिस इज द प्रोटीन कंसनट्रेशन दैट वी विल इंसर्ट हेयर लाइक हेयर वी हैव जीरो पॉइंट जीरो फाइव माइक्रोमोलर एंड द लीगन कंसनट्रेशन सो लीगन कंसनट्रेशन लेट सपोज वी हैव जीरो पॉइंट जीरो टू माइक्रोमोलर एंड द डिसोसिएशन कॉन्स्टेंट सो हेयर वी विल पुट डिसोसिएशन कॉन्स्टेंट एंड वी विल डिस्कस इन द इक्वेशन दैट वट वट इज द डिसोसिएशन कॉन्स्टेंट लेट सपोज वी आर पुटिंग हेयर दैट द डिसोसिएशन कॉन्स्टेंट इज जीरो पॉइंट जीरो वन एट and the ic50 value the inhibitor concentration will be let's suppose 16 now we will calculate the ki value for protein ligand inhibitor system so calculate so we now, now we uh, we are going to calculate the ki values so these are our parameters which we inserted and now these are the using free concentrations the ki for competitive or uncompetitive will be these values for ki so ki for competitive is 0.03 and for uncompetitive it is 0.1038 and uh, using total concentrations the ki for competitive is 0.07579 and for uh, uncompetitive it is 0.0842 so these are the ki values for uh, protein ligand inhibitor system uh, we have also some other parameters uh, we can calculate like here molecular species at 0% inhibition which which is positive control so at positive control p not it is the free protein and uh, it is 0.036 and for uncompetitive so these are the uh, actually these are the free protein free ligand and protein ligand complex concentrations and uh, for molecular species at 50% inhibition at 50% inhibition the p50 for free protein p50 means the uh, protein at 50% inhibition uh, will be 0.0907 for competitive and for uncompetitive it is 0.0359 and protein ligand complex for protein ligand complex at 50% inhibition is this values for competitive and uncompetitive and protein and ligand 50 ligand 50 means the 50% uh, inhibition of the ligand and uh, with with uh, with in, uh, inhibitor that we use and it in it is the 50 and here is the inhibitor 50 so for inhibitor 50 here we have competitive and uncompetitive values and this is the protein inhibitor complex which gives 50% inhibition so protein inhibitor complex for competitive and protein ligand inhibitor complex for 50% during uncompetitive because we know that in uncompetitive the complex will be protein ligand inhibitor so it these are the values in micromolar and here is the graph so we can uh, compare these values by graph uh, for competitive and uncompetitive and uh, blue lines represents classical type of inhibitor and uh, the brown lines represents tight inhibition and it, these are based on tight inhibition system similarly we can also uh, we can also observe graph in uh, enzyme substrate inhibitor system like here that we calculated and uh, after our calculations we so these are the graphs so here we have graphs for competitive uncompetitive and non competitive inhibition which represents comparison of the ki value and these these graphs are automated automatically these are generated by this application which is bat db now we can find out that in protein ligand system what are the equations that uh, that are involved so for literature we can also go to literature so from literature we can observe that what are the different literature which can be reported assumptions and the background so background
and uh, one thing that is mentioned here that we should note that the range of inhibitor potencies that can be resolved in fluorescence polarization based binding assay is limited to the affinity of the fluorescent ligand that uh, what is the interaction of the fluorescent ligand with the in a protein so the it depends so for inhibitor that binds with higher binding affinities than the fluorescent ligand it is not possible to calculate the ki value by this formulas or these calculations so the equations we are going to show you that but before this we should uh, know that the inhibitors that have higher affinity than the fluorescent ligand uh, we cannot calculate the ki value so for this the binding affinity of the inhibitor should be less than the fluorescent ligand so the now the equations uh, which are used so these equations i have also show 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 you showed you before but from here it is the these are the uh, equations which are used for protein ligand inhibitor interaction so for competitive species or competitive type of protein ligand interaction the ki value calculation of ki value depends on this equation and this equation contains the i50 which is inhibitor at 50% uh, ligand 50% inhibition kd is the dissociation constant p0 is the free protein and kd is again dissociation constant and here is the one so this is the equation and for this the values we used will be obtained from like here p0 is the free protein at 0% inhibition which is positive control and this equation is will be used for uh, free ligand at 0% inhibition which is also the positive control this equation will be used pl0 is the protein ligand complex at 0% inhibition it is also the positive control without any inhibitor and pl0 will be the p minus p0 p50 is the free protein at 50% inhibition without any ligand so for this this equation will be used l50 is the free ligand at 50% inhibition and this equation will be used for pl50 so pl50 is the protein ligand complex in case in presence of inhibitor and it is the 50% inhibition of the protein ligand so pl50 is equal to pl0 divided by 2 <coughs> i50 is the free inhibitor at 50% inhibition and pl i50 is the protein inhibitor protein ligand inhibitor at 50% inhibition and PLI50 is equal to IC50 minus I50. <coughs> For non-competitive type of uh, protein ligand complex inhibition, the KI value, we will use this equation for to calculate the KI value. So, but uh, we should know that we, we are not going to use these equations. It is already uh, used in this calculator. And we are only going to show you the literature that on what basis this calculator works. So for P0, free protein at 0% inhibition. Again, L0 is the free ligand at 0% inhibition. And all these values are the same. And these are the equations which will be used for non-competitive type of inhibition. So today we discussed the enzyme inhibitor system and protein ligand inhibitor system and what are the equations on what equations this calculator works. So this calculator works based on these equation and this is an important cal uh, calculator uh, which is bad db. So it is important to convert IC50 to KI values. So thanks for watching my video in our next video. Uh, we will come with some other interesting topics for you.